In this video, we ask, what's the problem? More precisely, what is the sustainability problem? So in this video, we're going to introduce the concept of sustainability and the concept of sustainable development. We're going to discuss how our current lifestyles and current way of living are probably unsustainable and why that means that we have to change our ways. So what do we mean by the term sustainability? What does it mean that something is sustainable or unsustainable? When we talk about sustainability, we're talking about the ability for something to endure over time, for something that can last, that can sort of carry itself over time. So the opposite then is if something is unsustainable, if it's not going to last, if it's not able to support uh, a lifestyle. And here's important to point out that something can be well functioning right now. It can be something that we like, but something that if we sort of drag it across over time, it won't be able to endure over a longer period of time. Sustainable development is development that meets the needs of the present without compromising future generations' ability to meet their own needs. So there are many interesting things here. One question, of course, is if we are even succeeding meeting the needs of the present generations, if we think about something like inequality, for instance, we can discuss whether, in fact, that first element is met. And it becomes even more difficult when we take into account the future. Is our current lifestyle taking away the ability of future generations to live in a way uh, that will be uh, comfortable and safe for them? We often split sustainable development into three. We talk about resources, the depletion of resources. We talk about uh, the ecosystem services and we talk about the social fabric or the society as a whole. And this indicates that there are both planetary boundaries that we need to take into account and there are societal boundaries that we need to take into account. And when we think about our current lifestyles, our current way of living, and the way that companies and other organizations are operating, it seems that we are not quite living up to uh, the definition of sustainable development. We started this video by asking what is the problem? What is the sustainability problem? And, and what's the problem, Lars Jakob, with us not being sustainable? Well, uh, if we want our planet to endure, and if we want the societies on that planet to not just endure, but also thrive, we need to be living our lives and extracting resources and using them in a way that allows us to do this uh, over time. We are dependent on clean water, clean air, a stable climate. There's so many needs that we have in the present and we're talking about sustainable development here. We also have, uh, we have to, to rig ourselves today in a way that does not destroy future generation and perhaps also the animals and other living things on the planet and destroy their ability to meet the needs of the future. And it's interesting that this relationship between environmental issues on the one hand and social issues on the other is uh, complex because as the climate gets increasingly warm, as water issues arise on several places in the planet, you get more migration, you get more social unrest. So there's also a relationship between those environmental indicators of sustainability and the social indicators of sustainability. So here we've given you a short introduction to the problem. We are going to look into some potential solutions here, Lars Jakob. Yeah, and some of those solutions will be driven by individuals like you and me. Some of them will be driven by governments and public organizations, and other again will have to be developed by companies who can design business models that solve some of these problems.